Tirei. Just want to keep a little bit of a record of how I'm doing. So I can have a look in the future. And say, oh, really, look, that was me there on that day. What day is it today? It's Just about April, really. So I'm still here, I haven't melted away, which is good. Fit distribution's changing. I think some of it, there's more in here, which I think I'm storing for energy. There's not much in this bit though. This bit's quite, quite, this fatty down up there. So that's cool. Hopefully that means most of the stuff that I'm carrying now will be that um, stuff that burns up quickly. You know how there's two kinds? There's the one that burns and the one that just sits there. Might be nice to do a cycling trip sometime there, or a kayaking trip, and just burn it all off, and then start again, and build it up a bit. I don't weigh myself, so I don't know how much it would fluctuate, because it doesn't fluctuate very much, so I don't bother weighing myself. It's always pretty much been the same since I was 16. Most it would have fluctuated would be about a kg. some of the exercises I do, a lot of them are very basic and simple. It's good to do the very basic and simple ones and not make them high or high impact. I sometimes do this kind of conditioning just a little bit. I don't do it very hard. Not so as it bruises. And this is only when the muscles were warmed up. Yeah, I'm not hitting the bone either. I never hit the bone. If I hit the bone, it's only this hard. muscle goes over the bone, mostly. So it's the best striking surface. I'm going to do the same in the opposite bit, but not all the way to the elbow, because I always avoid strikes on the elbow. It's not training for fighting, it's training for falling over. Don't do fighting anymore. You can help it. I hope no one thinks I'm showing off, this is just... 
I used to do this in the pack. You did it yourself. Quite gently on the joints. Quite a lot more gently than on the other bits, just for good luck. It's a striking area. Soft, soft strikes. That's fun. That's one there. 